Welcome back to the channel guys, Crypto Lightsaber back again with another video and today I want to talk to you about an issue that's been bothering me all week actually. Um, in a few of my videos I've mentioned the fact that um, I've been struggling to get my withdrawals from Bitmar. Um, if you look at the date here, we're looking at from the 5th of September, I've got withdrawal over here of Ethereum. I've also got a withdrawal on the 5th of September of XRP both of which still haven't gone through and today we're on the 13th of September. So that's really concerning that none of those have gone through. Um, constantly been messaging Bitmart um, in the Telegram group, constantly been um, submitting tickets for support on that and constantly keep getting the same answer, please be patient, kindly wait and so on, okay? Now this seems to have been happening ever since the Twee dump, all right? When we saw Twee come all the way from about $83 all the way down to a dollar okay ever since then bitmark seems to have been doing some sort of investigation and reviewing certain accounts for suspicious activity and things like that if you're following me on on my channel you obviously know that i'm not the cause of this dump you know i don't have uh, you know 30 million dollars or that kind of money to be able to dump all of that okay if you are following me on the channel you would have saw that i did catch the bounce and i managed to get out up here about about 46 dollars okay but it did take um some real you know really strong hand and i was basically you know just waiting for hours for that bounce that i knew would come all right and i managed to get out of that uh, made a great trade a great exit on that and took a great profit okay but i do seem to be suffering from it uh, uh because i can't withdraw my funds okay now what i've been doing is i've been experimenting today okay and i have managed to get some withdrawals out okay but there's there's some that have not come out all right so i managed to do a little bit of a test i bought 848 tron tokens okay and uh, that went through fine so i thought okay try to withdraw another 2700 in tron and that is still processing that doesn't seem to have come out all right guys um i then did a litecoin transaction about seven litecoin all right that managed to come out okay i've also done uh, a couple of uh, usdt uh, withdrawals okay tried one about five hundred dollars one just under a thousand dollars and they managed to come out okay i'm still waiting for a few but it does seem at the moment that anything under a thousand dollars seems to be coming through these withdrawals were both over a thousand dollars and they haven't come through okay and then we've got this withdrawal over here that was over two thousand dollars that hasn't come through all right guys so be careful when it comes to withdrawing from bitmart at the moment um i have been using bitmart for quite a long time obviously i promote them on the channel every day when i'm showing you charts from on bitmart spark point sharing and so on or uh, math wallet as well uh, but yeah um, at the moment uh it is a bit of a deep one if you do have money in uh, bitmart you might have trouble getting it out if you're trying to withdraw anything over a thousand dollars so i mean me i've gone for the 945 dollars i'm trying another one now for about 940 dollars i'm trying another trx one and i've still got this eos uh, transaction is pending this Litecoin transaction is pending all right so they're coming through when they're ready they're not as quick as i would like them to be but um, we'll have to wait and see if the rest of these come through now. But at the moment, it is a bit of a pain. I'm having to withdraw bit by bit into my Binance account. But um, And bearing that in mind, uh, you do get charged every single transaction that you do. So, uh, I mean, even the smallest transaction on Tether, on Bitmart, it's going to be $5, okay? So each Tether transaction that I've done on here cost me $5, okay? So if I do 10 transactions, it's going to cost me $50 if I'm using just Tether. That's why I'm mixing them up and I'm using other ones, okay? But I'm trying to get my uh, funds out quickly so I can, you know, do some things on other exchanges. I'm having to do it bit by bit. And that's my strategy for getting the money out of Bitmart at the moment, okay? So I believe that uh, they are doing manual reviews on many accounts especially if you did trade tweet okay um they've also got the automatic transfers which i'm 
I'm guessing that those are for transfers under a thousand dollars and that's just by you know I'm, I'm just putting two and two together by what I'm seeing here um, with this experiment all right guys so hopefully that can help you out another thing I will say that if you go in the telegram group on bitmart there's a lot of scammers uh, scouring bitmart at the moment I almost fell victim to a scammer uh, myself they pretended to be bitmart support they asked for my email address so they could check my withdrawals and stuff when i was querying it okay i almost fell for that and um you know i'm just glad that i didn't by the grace of god but um yeah watch out for that okay um they are uh, quite crafty and very smart um in their approach okay they might not just come straight out and ask you something they might say did you manage to sort out your withdrawal yet um, let us check it for you send us your email address and things like that and a lot of the times they'll they'll play they'll play the long game and they'll kind of go back and forth with you and then try and get you to offer the information to them or say you know uh, they might wait for you to say can you please check my account again and when you say that they'll say uh, okay send us your email address all right and they'll try and keep you on online with them as long as they can so that they can hack you all right so be careful with that all right and if you do get anything like that just block them and uh, report them let bitmark know um, in the group they will also um, delete them out of the group okay but yeah be very careful and i know it's not just on bitmark um uh, on bitmark's telegram group uh bitmark official there's there's also going to be people like that scammers in in other groups as well so be extra careful with that okay i can't warn you enough all right be extra careful okay now another thing that annoyed me about bitmart is the fact that when i did ask questions about my withdrawal the first time um, when i when i put a message just in, uh, on the telegram group to say that you know i've been waiting three days in response to somebody else who had been waiting a few hours i actually got banned okay no sorry at first the message got deleted okay then i thought well, that's strange i thought i'd message it again and I actually got banned for spamming okay i got banned for seven days until today all right and then mysteriously today um, when i was unbanned from writing messages okay somebody has reported me for spamming okay and uh, i've now been banned for 24 hours uh, by a telegram bot okay um, i'm not a spammer all right i'm just expressing my concern asking for a little bit of help with my withdrawal, withdrawal getting them to double check it okay they will send you a message back saying please submit a ticket here you can submit a ticket on the bitmark website okay but they actually do take a couple of days to get back to you they're not very quick and they don't get back to you with anything much they send you a generic message and they don't actually solve your problem for you okay all they're telling you to do is wait all right guys and that is not great especially when you're trying to move quick in this market i trade on several different exchanges it's a bit of a pain that i can't move my money and not only that i'm being forced to hold assets that i wouldn't normally hold xrp for example i only use xrp for my transfers okay but i've been forced to hold xrp um while xrp goes down okay i just had another transaction go through um, which I just got a message on my phone for that so that's good all right guys but yeah keep an eye on that all right if you are trying to withdraw like I said just do under a thousand dollars and you should be okay uh, potentially all right guys that's been done using Teba Tron okay uh, not sure about EOS yet all right but let's have a look let's see which one just went through okay we can see my Tron is almost going through as well okay uh whatever's almost going through eos is still not doing much all right but um yeah okay so while i was actually recording the video uh, my larger transaction for around two thousand seven hundred dollars and ninety one thousand uh, tron tokens actually went through okay so i'd have to take that back uh, the withdrawals are going through now at least um you know for that amount okay so it does turn out that the only ones that i'm waiting for or the ones that i, I were concerned about in the beginning uh, from the 5th of september I, I am still waiting for those okay those still haven't gone through but all the ones that i've tried today are coming through slowly all right guys um they're not as quick as i would like them to be i'm still waiting for a little bit of litecoin 
I'm still waiting for a little bit of uh, EOS tokens arrival. All the Tron TRX tokens have come through now. Okay, so yeah, um, maybe you won't experience problems, but it's still not good nevertheless. All right, and if you're like me and you've been waiting more than eight days for your tokens um, since last weekend, all right, leave me a comment down below. Let me know uh, uh, if you if you're having the same problem, guys. And uh, yeah, I mean that's it for now. All right. Um, hopefully things will go back to normal and there's nothing to worry about. But yeah, in the meantime, just be extra careful. All right, guys, uh, you know, the, the admins are not being very supportive with it. They're just saying, please wait and stuff like that. So I know a few people might be having those problems. Hopefully this video can encourage you. Um, I've been a uh, guinea pig and I've done the testing for you. All right. You can withdraw at the moment. OK, uh, especially if it's a small amount. All right, guys. So, yeah. That's it for now. Leave a like, comment down below, let me know what you think, and I'll see you guys in the next video. If you would like to support the channel, there's actually a way you can do that now while getting something out of it for yourself. We have a new clothing brand called Parabolic. This is a brand dedicated to the crypto space. I use the name Parabolic because that's the kind of movement we like to see in those charts. Now, there's a range of products you can choose from, from hoodies, vests, socks, even face masks during this pandemic time. And we're using the lightsaber to represent the YouTube channel. Okay, there'll be a link in the description so you can go and check that out. Got a range of different colors, range of different products, all right? And what I'll actually be doing is for the first 100 people that do actually buy something, if you send me a message, what I'll do is I'll send you a free invite for the new Telegram group, which will be a paid Telegram group, okay, after that. Okay, so the first 100 people, you will get an invite sent to you for free. All right, even if you buy something as small as a mug, you will get that just to show my appreciation for your support as well. Okay, guys, so you've got a chance to be the exclusive members of the new group. You've also got a chance to get your hands on some exclusive merchandise. So link in the description, get on over to the website and make your purchase now. Remember, the trend is your friend.